we have arrived to the place with the weights the weights to get bigger bigger equals stronger stronger equals bigger anyways i'm about to drink this rain energy i have not had one of these in probably four years i've had one of these since high school all right mm. brings back some memories of uh memories <laughs> Uh, it's kind of mid. Uh, I didn't even think rain. I thought rain was shutting down. Maybe that was a bang, which I saw a bang there too. So I don't think that's a I think it's a myth. I think it's a lie. But I'm about to bang out some back and buys. I weighed 187 today, guys. Then I proceeded to hop on the uh, the white toilet and then proceeded to and I'm back at 183. Let's talk about that. Why is bulking so freaking hard, bro? 185 is probably, it's the it's the number that I can't get past. I, I don't know, I just, my body right now is just like, no more food. And it's just hard, it's hard. But, I mean, we hit 187 today, so we, we definitely felt a little heavier. I knew I felt a little heavier right when I hop on the scale. I was like, yeah, I'm definitely past my, my mark. And looky, looky, we were. But, uh, yeah, we're about to bang out some back and buys. I definitely hit this with my, my friend a couple days ago. And it was uh, not a pretty pretty sight, for sure. I was sore AF, so I took an off day yesterday. I got mentally prepared. I'm still kind of feeling it a little bit. I'm kind of, I'm out of my groove right now, For to be honest with you guys. I'm, I need to uh, start destroying my body a lot more. But man, after school, man, I just, I nap. Like yesterday, oh my, I don't even know what got into me, but I fell asleep after school for four hours. It was like 3 to 7.30, bro. It was crazy. I, I woke up and I was just like, <clears throat> I was like, what is happening to me? I don't know. I don't know what's uh, what's on to me, but we're definitely going to still destroy our back and eyes today. Like, I mean, <laughs> it's the, it's one of my favorite days now. I mean, back. Once I get a bigger back, <laughs> I might be big, you know? That's just how it goes in the world. If you have a big back, you, uh, you're you big. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Uh, Valentine's Day is coming up. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Woo! Tomorrow, guys. Yeah. Uh... Barbella is going to be on my back. <laughs> We're going to be squatting. What a Valentine's Day to just destroy legs. Uh, yeah, so tomorrow's vid probably won't be up because I got work. Unfortunately, I got scheduled. So it's going to be a double wombo combo on Thursday. So look forward for that. Anyways, what are we gonna do in here? Obviously, to shore back. We're gonna hit. Some, we'll probably hit some incline curls. Cause I was looking at my peak, bro, and it's it's disgusting, bro. It makes me so it makes me so sad that I can't get bigger biceps, even though I spam them. I just spam biceps, and they won't grow. Ah, oh, fuck. Anyways, what else can we talk about in here? I sat in class all day. We were uh, hitting a practical for the, the barber, the barber practical all day long. So it was kind of a boring sesh, but I mean, it's whatever. You know, what I was thinking about, I took an off day yesterday, I'm ready to hit the gym. I'm just ready to hit the gym, so. I don't know. My, my life isn't really that bonkers. So I think we're just gonna hop in here and we're gonna destroy our back, so let's get in there. I clearly fly straight out of my teeth. I weigh 187 right now, so three more pounds, and we hit the 190, then we're gonna hit the 200, and then we're gonna cut, guys. I am feeling it now, all right? Right when I hop on that scale right before I came in here, don't get addicted to that, by the way. I'm, a, I'm seriously addicted to that shit. I like to see if my gravitational pull is a lot more, but you should probably not hop on the scale every single fucking day like I do, but I just wanna, I wanna get this bulk over with, all right? 
I'm enjoying the ride, but then it's to a point of like I'm eating a lot and I fucking hate it. Like I, I'm a, I'm running out of stomach space. You know what I'm saying? Then you're good, bro. Uh, so we're about to hit this shit. What are we pulling today? 187. My back is already kind of sore, like I said, because I, I hit it a couple days with my bro, and it wasn't the greatest lift, so, you know, I don't want to skip on the back game, so let's hit this shit. <laughs> freaking strap always fucking slides over so let's figure this out i consider that a warm-up all right let's get to work Swifties to get another thing, all right? Another Super Bowl. It is the most annoying thing to see them just posting her everywhere. Like, no one cares. And the more I, like, watch it and to see all the memes and see how it all turned out, the more I think it's scripted. It's actually disgusting. Let's be honest. We all called that Swifties are going to win that shit. God, I hate that shit so much. I'm just going to take my pan out on this rose and maybe be happy. Hopefully Jalen Hurts can uh, win next year. try these straps out even though it's pretty close grip and I think I feel like a like I'm not doing anything in particular with the grip with this but you know whatever floats my boat <laughs> Something else. 
can come in here and spam 40 pounds. Are you really like, are you really pushing yourself? You need to have the at least 90% good form and then push as much as weight as you can because you're using your back on fucking everything, man. The only way you're gonna grow your back, you get to pull fucking heavy ass fucking weight. I mean, think about it. You're, you're using it on, on bench, you're using it on squat. You're, you're, it's keeping your body straight up. So, the only way you're gonna stimulate it, heavy ass fucking weight. So, my form isn't the greatest today. It's whatever. I mean, I still feel a pump coming. What is this? God, these things confuse me. Let's hop on this uh, horseback. Really push myself to uh, to failure today. I can't. I can't feel my back right now. So I've been watching a little One Piece again. Let's see what episode I'm on, actually. Three sixteen, bro. Why? My question is. Luffy's him, obviously, but why does he have so many fa fucking family members that are him also? No wonder he has that, he has that him DNA, you know? Whatever that general's name is, Grandpa, that's Ace. There's probably gonna be another motherfucker that comes in and it's probably gonna be the same exact DNA as him. But, I mean, the thumbnail on this one, Shanks, everyone comes back in. It's actually, it's, it's the greatest anime ever made. All right, if you sit down and you actually watch it and experience the the ride you won't be disappointed now everyone complains that it's like long as fuck who cares bro it's about the journey it's about getting the one piece anyways I'm just thinking I have, I have legs on Valentine's Day. That is so disappointing. <laughs> Joe Jim Shoddy, no Jim Shoddy, just Barbella on me. It's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be an adventure for sure. I really wanted to squat in here, but I've worked, so I'm about to go to the, the mid gym tomorrow. I swear every time I'm back there, it's packed AF in here, and I don't like it. I want to try out the new machines, but we had to deal with it. You know, I kind of like this one. This is a lot more. Uh, what is this called? Inclined or decline? Actually forced me to actually stretch it instead of being up here. And let me tell you, my back is numb right now. I can't feel anything. My last six sets, I'm straight pumping. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. What is wrong with me? Droppy. So I've been eating chicken and rice this bulk, or this period of bulk, and I've been on the ground beef grind. I think I've ate too much chicken in my life. I hate it. I get it if you cook it right, it's all still juicy and shit, but I air fry that shit, you know? I get it frozen, I let it thaw out, and I air fry that motherfucker. And I season that all the way up. It just doesn't taste as good as beef, man. I think it's, chicken is so mid, 
I can get it. I can come in Cane's, destroy Caniac meal with the sauce, but when it comes to grilled chicken at the home variety, it's a struggle to get down. And uh, they're only like 190 calories, so the more you eat, or you get to eat more of those, you know? Instead of ground beef, it's like, I think like 240, something like that, in the 200s. Since I brought my intensity up in all these lifts and actually pushed myself to failure, I think it's so much better than counting your reps. Like you make you get like 20 on one arm and 12 on the other arm, and it's probably not the greatest for your for your you know each side proportion. But I mean, if you come in here and hit three sets of eight, four sets of ten, you know, have a set number, you probably have a lot more energy than you think. And plus, you're probably not pushing the weight. Yeah, you could you know be tired at the end of ten. But in reality, mind over matter, you probably can hit three, four more reps of whatever you're doing. Now, when it comes down to compound lifts, I get it, man. I, I just want a one record. But that's all about strength training. Now, when it comes to auxiliary shit, like back, bicep curls, any of that, you know, you want to just push as much as you can, man. That's, uh, that's what's on my mind. I get it. I, I tell people what to do, and it's like, it's easy. Okay, go up and wait, bro. Go up, do another set, you know? I'm talking to one of my bros, all right? Not to call you out or anything at all, all right? But don't be scared to go up and freaking wait. He just told me I don't have a spotter, bro. You have the safety bars for a reason. 
Now, if you fail and you fall down and you, you know, you cry about it, that should push you on the next lift to do better. Because failure, you're always gonna fail to succeed, you know what I'm saying? Don't be scared to go up and wait. No, you can ego lift just a tad. As long as it's not fucking, oh my God, I'm throwing out my lower back on, on any of these lifts, because it's usually lower back or, yeah, it's usually lower back, but. If you can stay with the same weight every lift, you're not pushing yourself, you're not getting bigger. You're just coming in here and just BSing it out, to be honest. BSing around, honestly, when I could just be reading, even though it's kind of like a comic book. It's still reading, it's still reading. push through it and you gotta see the light at the end of the tunnel. You gotta see yourself, you know, two months in advance and then the future will be cut. And I think I'm gonna look dicey. My chest has grown so much from the split. I'm, uh, I'm pretty excited for this shit. Wow. 
what I am excited about. My Asian bro's back from the military. Oh, we're gonna punish him for sure. It's gonna be a very humbling lift for him. I see him that he's pushing weight. He's gained a lot. I think he went on a cut actually. But we'll see how it's, we're gonna test the waters out and see if the military really made him a man in here. That'll be probably next week. Oh, I'm excited to see that motherfucker. Just, uh, just to punish him. This is like as tall as me. It's very, uh, it's very sad. But this is an 80. They have 70s over there, so I guess it's new things. You know, if I get humbled, I get humbled. But next set, we're gonna get a, uh, we're gonna get spot. Really push ourselves, and we're gonna go flex in the mirror. Hearts are in the way. I see what we're working with today. My lats destroyed. Not gonna lie. We are feeling it from just pulling shit. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This bulk is, uh, when I take my shirt off without the pump, we feel fat, but with this bulk, man, it still can't last bread. I just can't do it. I can't do it. One of these days we'll, we'll bang this out. I just don't have that mobility for real. Oh, okay. Oh. I'm proud of my chest, man. Ooh. We are definitely growing. Oh yeah, I love back. Slowly becoming my favorite lift. I've neg neglected it for so long, but we are in now. But let's get out of here. 